Hey guys, this is Bobby with Potomac Bass Cats, and I just wanted to show you a little something. I'm out here on my local lake today. It's just a beautiful day, so I decided not to waste it, get out here and test out some baits I bought. And I've got this uh, Mike Buca bull herring tied on, just giving it a couple casts out, wondering if it actually looks real. I think it looks pretty good. Then I, I just casted it out and had a whole school of shad follow this thing into the bank like it was the leader of the pack. So. I'm going to try to get this on camera. The water's a little bit stained. It's probably going to be impossible to do, but I got to try to do this for y'all. So uh, stay tuned and enjoy. I'll try to get these shed to follow this thing in and maybe hopefully a giant bass to bite. So take care. As I said before, the camera's all jacked up. As I said before, Got the bull herring tied on. This thing's pretty sweet. Let me just throw this right here so you guys can see this a little bit. It looks really good in the water. You can kill it, make it twitch, and go sideways, and all kinds of stuff. Not that time. They're on to me. They're not playing this game anymore. All right, guys, I'll get back to you. All right, the shad spawn is on, guys. See that? It's a bunch of gizzard shad in here swirling about in these rocks. I'm gonna see if they uh, try to spawn with my Mike Buca bull herring. I just had a chase on this herring. A little bass, I think.
Oh wow, did you see that? They came in after it. They want to mate with this thing bad. I'm gonna try to get a better angle. See them all? <laughs> I wish I had my net. All right, we're gonna do this one more time so you guys can try to see it. Well, if it looks real enough for the fish to want to mate with it, hopefully it looks real enough for the bass to want to eat it one of these days. That's my take on it, at least. Well, I hope you can see that. I'm going to keep the camera ready. In case something else chases it, but so far the shatter fooled. Probably spooked everything here with that giant ass shed. Sorry, herring. Strike King KVD 1.0, one of my favorite baits. It's a great all around crankbait. So, here's one of my local lake monsters. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that's a, probably a 20 or 25 pound grass carp right there. Think about coming down here this weekend, maybe fishing for these guys. It's a, it's a big one. Hey guys, well that wraps up my video for today. Um, I actually got a visit from the game warden about five minutes later and found out that my fishing license has expired uh, two days ago. So <laughs> I need to go get that taken care of. Um, he did not write me a ticket, thank God, really nice guy. He kind of realized that I had no idea and that I had every other license for this entire area valid. So he realized I wasn't trying to scam him, I think. But definitely make sure you are licensed if you're going to be out in public areas. Uh, they do come around. They do check up on you. And you will get a ticket. And it's not cool. So thank you, Mr. Game Warden. I really appreciate it. But that concludes my video for today. I do really like the Mike Buca bull herring. I think it's going to be a great bait. I cannot wait to get that thing out on the Potomac. I think it's going to catch some freaking pigs. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. Sorry there's no fish catches for today. But... I was just really out testing lures and thought I'd film a couple cool things while I could see them. So, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you guys again soon. Thanks for watching.